In this video, I'll be sharing how to take attendance in the attend student attendance management module. So here I will show you the way to take the attendance. So in the take attendance option, we have three different options. Attendance by absent number, attendance by subject lab, and upload via Excel. First, I'll share information by attendance by absent number. So I'll click on attendance by absent number. As soon as I click on the attendance by absent number, it will take to a new page where you have to select the department for which you want to select, uh, take the attendance, select the classroom, and select the date for which you want to take the attendance. Here we have an option to select the multiple classroom for which you want to take the attendance. As of now, I'll be taking the attendance for one classroom. As soon as I've selected the department, classroom and date, I'll click on fill attendance. As soon as I click on fill attendance, a new option would be uh, coming onto your screen with under the fill attendance section. So in this fill attendance section, you can select the time for which you want to take the attendance, select the faculty for which who's taking attendance. And then the option is for absent or not. So here, as, as per the name of the tab, attendance by absent number, we can take attendance for all the students who are absent in the specific class. So to take the attendance for the specific uh, student by checking like for which student was absent. So I just need to select that student. So as of now, student number one was absent. So I'll select student number one. Then student number four was absent. So I have to select the student number four. As soon as I select the students, who are absent for the specific class. And then I have to click on save attendance. As soon as I click on save attendance, notification would be going to all the students or parents as per the option you have selected over on this screen. I'll, if I select the SMS to student, this notification will go to all the students. If I select for the parents, it will go to all the parents. So you can select the option as per your choice. After you select the option, you can click on save attendance and then you will get a notification. Are you sure you want to submit the attendance? Then you just have to click on OK. Once you click on OK, you would get this option attendance up updated successfully. That means your attendance by the absent number has been uploaded successfully. Now we will go to the third option that is upload via Excel. So here, as soon as you open this page, you would be able to see the download attendance sheet. So here we can select the department, select for which classroom you want to take the attendance, then select the teacher, then select the date. So for an example, if I want to select uh, take an attendance for today's date, I'll select the date, then I'll select the time for which I want to take the attendance. Then you just select this sort by option, like how you want to download the Excel sheet, by name, by student's name or by role number. So I'll keep its role number. And then I'll click on download attendance sheet. As soon as I click on download attendance sheet, that sheet will be downloaded on your screen. You have to open that sheet and by default, it would be present for all the students. So to make sure like the attendance is taken careful, I mean, properly, you need to enter the details for those students who are absent. You just have to write A, capital A. As soon as you write capital A and save the file, you can select the file from this option and then you click on up, up, upload attendance sheet. As, you, as soon as you click on upload attendance sheet, your attendance for that specific date would be uploaded into the system. Now we will go to the second option, which is the attendance by subject lab. <clears throat> so your attendance by subject lab means like most of the schools have theory as well as the labs sessions or classes for different different subjects. For an example, computer, for computer like computer lecture, we have theory class as well, the lab class as well. So we can take attendance according. So we can take attendance for computer class theory as well as we can take attendance for computer lab. But to create the computer lab and to take attendance, we need to create the lab for the specific subject in the institute management. So here, this is how the three ways you can take attendance 
for all the students into your institute. Thank you.